L.R. the liberal redneck here, coming to you from a country where the Republican Party is hell-bent on destroying the two best programs ever created by our government, Social Security and Medicare, by turning both programs over to the private sector. The fact that both of these enormously successful programs were created by Democrats certainly has a bearing on their animosity. But the current attack led, led by Senate Majority Leader Moscow Mitch has more to do with the gigantic tax break they passed on to rich people. Because of their actions, our country is facing unheard of levels of deficits, and the party of fiscal conservatism is scrambling to come up with a solution that keeps the tax breaks and avoids the deficits created by turning off the money faucet from the rich taxpayers. Their solution is to take both programs off the government's obligations and turn them over to private business interests. We have recently seen firsthand how utterly ridiculous such a move would be in the debacle created by the private for-profit prisons handling the atrocious immigrant situation created by our president. To be perfectly clear, they do not want American taxpayers to stop, spend, stop, stop sending that monthly cash contribution for Social Security and Medicare. They just want us to send it to newly created for-profit manifestations. That way, the rich could get even richer by directly fleecing American taxpayers, and the fiscal responsibility would be off the government's ledgers. We have been getting horrible reports from the new concentration camps of abuse and neglect in spite of the enormous amounts of money they are getting for each internee. This is exactly what would happen if Social Security and Medicare were to travel down the private sector road. Both programs would turn to crap, and senior citizens would be thrown onto the trash heap. Democrats want to improve both programs. They want to expand both programs and make a lifetime of sacrifice by our citizens paying into those programs a worthy effort. The solution is obvious. Elect Democrats or suffer the consequences. It could not be any plainer. You can reach me at the liberal redneck at gmail.com and you can visit live with me, the pagan goddess and the progressive Christian for our weekly wrap up every Friday at noon central on blogtalkradio.com forward slash the liberal redneck. Thanks for watching.